Do you have ED, cold hands and feet, or an elevation in blood pressure? This may be the cause. Hey everyone, Dr. Nathan Bryan here, International Leader in Molecular Medicine and Nitric Oxide Biochemistry. And it's really the loss of nitric oxide that leads to erectile dysfunction, that leads to microcirculation deficiencies in cold hands and cold feet. And it's a lack of nitric oxide production that leads to an increase in blood pressure. So if you suffer from all of those, I think you have to be cognizant of the fact that pay attention to what you're doing that may be leading to a loss of nitric oxide production. Cold hands and feet is a microvascular disease. Many times it's called by hypothyroidism. But if we can produce nitric oxide, we can dilate those small blood vessels and start perfusing the, the hands, the feet, and increased warmth and blood flow and oxygen delivery to where we can overcome that. If you have erectile dysfunction, that means that the blood vessels of the sex organs aren't producing enough nitric oxide to dilate, to get engorgement, to cause an erection. An erection in both men and women, a penile and a clitoral erection, are dependent upon nitric oxide production. And then thirdly, if you have an elevation in blood pressure, really anything over 120 over 80, every one millimeter increase in blood pressure from 120 systolic is a 1% increase in your risk for heart attack, stroke, and cardiovascular disease. So if you've got a systolic pressure of 130, you've got a 10% increase in risk of cardiovascular disease. And that's a nitric oxide deficiency symptom because we all have the same amount of blood pumping through our body as individuals. And if we can't make nitric oxide, the blood vessels are constricted. So now we've got a finite volume of blood pumping through smaller vessels, smaller pipes, and physics tell us that blood pressure goes up. If we can optimize nitric oxide production, restore the, the ability to make nitric oxide naturally, we can dilate the blood vessels. Now with the same volume of blood through bigger pipes, pressure comes down. Nitric oxide fixes the physics problem of high blood pressure and hypertension. So you want to overcome erectile dysfunction, overcome the number one driver of cardiovascular disease, the high blood pressure, and you want to correct cold hands and cold feet, consider nitric oxide, restore your nitric oxide production, and it'll address all three of those.